evening bomb me and lebon tate um i think i already passed my comment in the written section and okay a couple of you where it's pur- it's purposefully designed to exclude women and strategically keeps maintaining that gender balance like that when you look look at it you will see that women is very difficult and i think also now I'm talking to more member 10 a number of people that i realize here coming from academia um there are a lot of courses that would allow women to join the sectors that and still be women and still maintain that work balance lifestyle approach but for us to access those we would have to leave our kids behind so that also contributes to us us going further so in some ways i feel like there is a need to now i'm talking to researchers like kahad to actually strategically review how and where are we as women not able to access those skills that will allow us to be leaders effective and efficient leaders i think mempu talked about it and said once we've been given a position we should be able to work and work hard but we find ourselves bending ourselves to the ground because even the skills that we have to do to compete with men we were not able to access them because i was busy kisaola kisalale bana and all of those things that as materials in the we need my daughter is 16 she's urgently looking for stories of basotho women and they're not there hi i see her waving <laughs> there aren't enough stories about basotho women when mempu was making a presentation presentation she talked about mantatis there is zero mention of mantatis in our history in our culture in our refined pieces of it here and there when the soto gained independence the leader then let it be known let it be on record it was the queen mantheb she took this country to democracy guys now this generation that falls into mem who talk about different things in different platforms there is a new part about her life story about who and how she became who she was and who inspired her and who shaped her uh, and how she purposefully pursued her country uh, her career that needs to be documented so that we can share it more so bomme ga kopa ga kopa start documenting your life we really need to hear more about your lives ke kopa o thula e mebo ya ne ba le kwa ga le boa we really welcome that intervention and academics present here Let's write women's history that's the invitation we will take it seriously as the Mushesha Institute we hear you we hear you and we know it's an important intervention that's needed Nampu but I want to respond to something that there's a I want to a small response is male orientated and is very discriminatory towards women I beg to differ we as women who have been who are who are fortunate enough to be in positions of power or in positions where we can employ other women she should employ people who are doing who are doing those the work that she ought to do like mohlawula and not only employ them but make sure that she puts their children in school to advance them. that's what we are talking about you hold other women as you move along today they in roma there is a woman who helped me when i was working i have never been more proud that's a queen i above all other queens she is a woman who worked at the factories she came and to come and help me in my home my own home she has three girls all of them are academics all of them had have masters degrees all of them the three girls and this she did while working while well, now working with me and i was now holding her hand I went to this woman's house I nearly died when I went there this woman has worked her husband worked in the mines and she worked to make sure that she has a home better than any other home around her so women queens when we have people who work in our homes they have rem- let's remember they come from somewhere they they have to the least you could do is to put one or some of their children in school this dimpose is so she knows what i'm talking about that is a requirement so we can't say we are held back because of the chores that we have to do let's employ other people to do those chores 
and help them in other ways. So this is how women advance each other. So tomorrow when I look at the director in the central bank who is Mema Palesa's daughter, I, 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 I smile. I have, there, there, is never, there is not no more gratification better when you actually push someone up the ladder. That's what we are supposed to do. We have to challenge each other to do the right things. It, our being held back, it should not be because of us not staying because we are doing something. It should be because somebody else is holding, holding us back just because they think we are women and can't do it. And even then, let's gang together and fight for, 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 for the position and move forward. We, we want to hear something next year about this construction work, how you, you maneuvered that and what you did. And if you can't get help, let's all get together and help you move forward. <laughs>